Uh, good morning in regards to all. I'll be focusing exactly uh, for the questions which came. Uh, let me just check. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Good morning in regards to all. Let's start over the first question. The first question was regarding the uh, what pressure popper valve is released in bag and mass ventilation. The best answer for this question is option number A, 30 to 40 centimeter of water. The pressure, what pressure popper valve is re released in bag and mass, 30 to 40 centimeter is the best answer. The next question was regarding the congenital hypertrophic pyloric stenosis, male patient, olive shaped mass, left to right paralysis. They said that ultrasound was given given and 4 mm in thickness and uh, 16 mm in length was the exam question next we have uh, congenital toxoplasmosis triad was given which is uh, intracranial diffuse calcification scoriotinitis and hydrocephalus this question a simple question regarding this abcd was given regarding all the growth so 2 year 6 year and 12 year is important 12 year old we have 2 p and s puberty maximum comes by 12 years somatic growth maximum by 12 years and lymphoid growth maximum by six years and brain development brain growth maximum by two years the next question came regarding the bladder exhaust trophy image based question the next was most common type of congenital diaphragmatic hernia is a posterior lateral variety that is a bog black hernia next question was two-year-old child came with vital stable and showing uh, this uh, proximal supraventricular tachycardia for which we all know the drug of choice is adenosine and we start off with 0.1 mg per kg remember always this is the book picture so the second line it is given give 0.1 mg per kg over one, two, three seconds at the first attempt. Next question we have over here is this one. One mother had bought her child for evaluation for diphtheria in which child had low-grade fever, pseudomembranes over tonsils, and her one sibling is fully immunized. So what is the profile access given to her siblings? Now, this is also a nice, interesting question. The only highlighter is uh, two things are there. In this question, the sibling is fully immunized. According to the OP guy picture, this very importantly, last point, uh, previously immunized asymptomatic patient should receive a booster dose of diphtheria toxoid. So the best answer for this question will be diphtheria toxoid because previously immunized asymptomatic patients so this question the best answer will be diphtheria toxoid single dose this a would be the best answer for this question last questions uh ilr iceland refrigerator image was there and in lowest compartment which vaccine is kept so lowest we all know we kept we put the opv vaccine this is the ilr refrigerator the last one we keep is the opv vaccine and what else that's it the question khatam this was the questions proper video i'll make it later thank you so much over to the next person.